Hello, I'm Pavel Vyatrak. I'm uh, a technical director at the Cytosam, which is located in Salt Lake City. And what we have here, uh, we have a DPPH oxidant, and I will show you the demo. But before that, let's go back and talk why we need to, um, to apply the antioxidants or the product with the high antioxidant activity to the crop. As we know, when the plant is going under the stress, yeah. could be uh, drought, heat, cold, uh, UV radiation, over application of the uh, pesticides or fertilizer, well, it will, uh, it will uh, generate a lot of stress in the plant. So what is happening during the time? There's an overproduction of those reactive oxygen species, which in the literature are also called free radicals. So because of the stress, what we sometimes see, the plants are smaller. Uh, and, and, and of course, the production is much reduced. So one of the ways uh, to help the plant overcome the stress is to reduce those reactive oxygen species. Why this is important? Well, when you have overproduction of those reactive oxygen species, these are the compounds with the oxygen, which basically damage the organelles in the cell, damage the cell wall, and what we see on the surface of the leaf, first yellowing and then brown spots. Of course, we reduce the leaf area, we reduce the photosynthesis, and because of that, the yield is reduced. Because as we know, the photosynthesis is correlated with the yield. The lower the photosynthesis, the lower the yield. So one of the major things is to help the plant overcome the stress, or in other words, reduce those reactive overproduction of those reactive oxygen species. So we are doing here, we are using the DPPH oxidant, which can be purchased online. It comes in the small uh, crystals, almost like a powder. We add pure ethanol, we add distilled water, and we get uh, the um, DPPH solution, purple solution. And of course, there are many products on the market, some of them uh, claiming some antioxidant activity. So I will show you the demo using some of the uh, some of the products, let's say some of the seaweed extract. And in the literature, some literature said there may be some antioxidant activity, some other literature says it's not confirmed. So what I will do here, let's start with the maybe one drop and then if not, maybe a few more drops and see if we can change the color of the purple solution. So add right now one drop of the product. No change. Let's add four more drops. Okay. Total five drops. No color change. Okay. So this is the seaweed. Then we'll do the same thing with the product claiming antioxidant activity. First we add one drop. If the color doesn't change, then we add a few more drops. So let's start with one drop first. Okay. Mix it. No color change. Let's add four more drops. Okay, total five drops. There's not much really color change here. And now what we'll do, we'll use the crop plus from Cytosam. The label. Then we shake it. And we'll do the same thing. Let's add one drop and see if we can change the color. Okay, one drop of the product. Very quickly change the color. What it means? It means that crop plus has very high antioxidant activity. 
now to make it more interesting, somebody may be asking, okay, what if we add one drop of crop plus to the other product? Okay, so let's try it. See if we can change change the color. Okay. Very quickly change the color. Now to the product where we, which was we supposed to have antioxidant antioxidant activity. Okay. Very quickly change the color. What is indicates there? Even if the grower is using other products, it's okay because some growers maybe may have already program which already working well for them. So they can add crop plus to add additional benefits. Let's say in this case, very high antioxidant activity to help uh, reduce the reactive oxygen species, help the plant overcome stress, and. With less stress, we can produce really higher quality uh, yield. So this is the main idea. But this is not the end of the story. This product is naturally chelated. So the minerals in this product are combined with amino acids, carboxylic acids, and carbohydrates. So the absorption rate is very high. So within hours after the application, the product can be absorbed. So even if we have rain seven or eight hours after the application, the grower doesn't have to reapply the product to the grower. So we have two benefits. Helping plant overcome stress through a reduction of the reactive oxygen species and additionally add the micronutrients which help the plant to grow and produce higher quality yield.